my name is Eileen Perez, I'm an astrophysicist, and this is, is mass in outer space equivalent to weight on Earth. So mass and weight are different things. The mass of an object is a fundamental property. It means how much matter that object has. So let's say you have a 10 kilogram ball. If this is in outer space, it's still 10 kilograms. If it's on Earth, it's still 10 kilograms. Now, how come in space things flow and on Earth things fall to the bottom? And it's because on Earth, mass experiences the, the gravitational forces and therefore its weight changes. So weight is a measurement of how mass reacts with the gravitational pull of an object. Now, on Earth, our gravitational strength is 9.8 meters per second square. Now, how do we determine Using this gravitational strength, how do we determine um, how, how heavy are you on Earth? So the weight is the mass of the object times this gravitational strength. And this is for, for Earth. So let's say you have the 10 pound ball in space, it doesn't matter. But if you have this 10 pound ball here on Earth, you will have 10 kilograms times 9.8 meters per second square. So this has the units of force, therefore we can call that a newton. So here, if we multiply this, we have 98 newtons. So that means that the weight of the 10 kilogram ball on Earth will be 98 newtons. So as you can tell, mass and weight are completely different things. So just to summarize, uh, mass is equivalent everywhere. It's a fundamental property, it's just how much matter you have in that object. And weight is how that matter behaves under a gravitational field. My name is Eileen Perez. I'm an astrophysicist and this is is the outer is the mass in outer space equivalent to weight on Earth. Mm -hmm.